listen to this. Up until this season, the Georgia School for Innovations and Classics had never won a football game. This year, they've won two in a row and stand undefeated. Joseph Doring tells us how the tide has changed in Hepzibah. A school that didn't have enough players to field a team last year and didn't even have a home field until this year. The Georgia School of Innovation and Classics varsity football team has faced many challenges since the program was founded in 2020. This year, the school has brought in a new leader on the sidelines. We want to play football. We want to play football the way that it's supposed to be played, and I'm not sure it was like that before. Head coach Arthur Marshall III has already led the GSIC Patriots to two wins to start the season, taking down Community Christian and Palmetto Christian. Two more wins than the school has ever seen in program history. The boys needed something to believe in, and I'm glad that we were able to get, we were able to get that first win. I think the previous coaching staffs definitely did the best job that they could. Coach Marshall's roster this year consists of less than 30 players. Some of them are upperclassmen who have never played football in their entire lives. I have two seniors that start that have never played football, so. It's more so being more so been that that learning curve to get them caught up to speed. Regardless of the size of the team, they haven't lost a game so far this year, and the smaller roster has only helped to create an even closer bond between its players. It's definitely good to see all the guys just happy and just to be just like just to have the morale up and just to have a good standard from which uh, Coach Marshall put in. It's like a family. It's like a it's like another family. GSIC will look to keep making history this season Friday night as they host the defending South Carolina state champions, the Jefferson Davis Academy Raiders. Joseph Doring on your side.